Okie dokie. Well, hi everybody. I'm well, back on once again and time for some more pinball. Um, well, to start with, um, my back is getting better. Uh, for those that don't know, yesterday I slept wrong apparently. Uh, I ended up ripping the shit on my whole upper back from like, from like shoulder blade to shoulder blade. It hurt like crazy. So, yeah. So, but today, um, like I said, it is starting to get better. Um, but, um, I should probably also mention too, uh, tomorrow, if, uh, if I don't think my back is sufficiently healed up enough, I may end up calling in. Yeah, because I definitely can't go into work with my, uh, upper back being, being like it is. Um, so, just to put that out there, um, there may be a chance that tomorrow I might be calling in. So, <sighs> otherwise, not a whole lot else to talk about. Um, it's, um. Today is um, the new uh, FX3 matchup week, so I'll be spending a good chunk of time on that, trying to get myself um, trying to get myself uh, sturdy and stable for the week. I'll have to take a look at the tables. I don't know what they are, but yeah. And then, probably like it's been going on lately, um, not really gonna go too all in on the tourneys. I haven't been lately. I really sucked ass yesterday, so I don't have that much of an incentive to keep going today and then but it, anyway uh, for those that don't know these days I'm trying to I'm trying to divide my time between all three platforms now like I'm including Zachariah in my pinball diet now playing it more so because of that I'm probably gonna be playing on FX3 less so, it used to be it used to be just FX3 and pinball arcade and um only playing Zachariah when I'm when I really sucked ass on uh, one or two of the other platforms. So it's Zachariah was a place that I I would only play it when I had to, not when I wanted to. So, um. Oh, hey Keith. Otherwise, um. Oh, Keith. Um, I'll rewind back a little bit. But yeah, my upper back's getting better. Um, it's not fully healed. It still kind of hurts a little bit. I just took a couple, uh, I just took a couple type, I just took a couple Tylenol, a little lapse in English. Um, so I'm hoping that's going to help it out some. But, um, tomorrow there may be a chance I might be calling in sick from work because, again, if it, um, if it hasn't healed up enough, then, yeah, I, because... I can't go into the start of a work week with any injuries. Oh, hey, Astro. See, like I said, I can't, uh, I can't go into work with any uh, injuries, especially at the start of the work week. So, um, yeah. yeah, otherwise, can't really think of anything else. Just, was well, eating the usual, having a hard-boiled egg with salt and pepper, and, um, got a Hand me some green grapes instead. The I've got some red grapes left, but they're all like they're all like real sticky and stuff. I still have yet yet to uh, rinse them off. So. It's time to do. do, do, do. Uh, nothing real favorable. Okay, one thing I do need to do, I gotta get my fan on the floor. Ball going as quickly as possible. Get your paws off me. Yeah, 
answer a call. That don't happen often. Getting multi-ball going right at the start. Well down the sides. All right, so guess I'm gonna have to go wireless. Can't be having that shit happen. Too much caffeine for that guy. Uh, something of what happened when there was only 10 seconds left. I won't be doing this one. I won't be doing that one again. Captain America. On your feet, soldiers. We've got a job to do. Yeah, that's what I gotta aim for. It's uh, the little flashing white target back there.
Ah, uh, ate my input. To beat it. Jurassic Park, Pinball Mayhem. All right, now you go in nice and slow. Hit the tail of the Stegosaurus. Locking the ball. Scanning the area. Progressive Jurassic Park slingshots. I'm sending in reinforcements to help you out. Supplies. Supply drop secure. Thanks. Requesting medevac for injured personnel. Nice! this table. Not when that shit's happening. Oh, also, when I'm playing with, um, when I'm playing wirelessly, I gotta deal with input lag, so...
Oh. Park slingshots. Hopefully. Jurassic Park slingshots. So sure now, Keith. Jurassic Park slingshots. You could just breathe on them and they go off. Yeah. No, I did it. That's probably gonna have to be my farm table. Uh, not with a score like that, though. Oh. 
Fuck. Oh. Fuck. It's official. You will suck. Up so much for that. Captain America, but it's too much of a pain in the ass because you have to do very specific shots and uh, you have to get super lucky with that. Yeah. Captain America.
Again, it's uh, flashing white. It's capped the ball way at the back. Yeah, looks like it ain't gonna happen. Yep. Shots lit. Not gonna hit. So, way it's looking right now, um, uh, I might just say fuck it to the, uh, matchups. Yeah. Captain America. Oh, I'll show you. I fight to win. Or die. During that mode, this is what you gotta aim for. This uh, captain ball. It'll be uh, yeah, the one you have to hit will be flashing white. I will try. Where you at, ball? Now, you can do, um, you can do death ray, but now, um, you have to aim for the bumpers. But of course, when the shot's lit, not gonna hit. It's like, I can only get that up. It'll be the flashing yellow star on the far right, right around there, that I can't hit. Yay! Limp dick. Do you think you can enter Castle Zemo and walk away unharmed? So, yeah. It... Nice try, Zemo. I don't. I do have to go over there. Got a Mr. Ray. Gotta get the ball in the upper right flipper. Good luck on that. Whoa, how about that? I actually made it when it mattered. So 
So, 90. Captain America. All right, men, you have your orders. Gotcha. So yeah, but all these modes suck, but it seems to be the only chance I got. Where you at, ball? Shots are lit. None are gonna get hit, seems. Jurassic Park sling shots. And there's me flubbing the flippers. Ah, uh, that didn't register. Yeah, I guess I didn't register. I'd like to get at least 200 points.
Small skill shot for me. It up. So we'll try this. We'll try going for multi ball. See how well this works. Lamp deck. Oh, there goes one. Yes, maybe I shouldn't have bothered. Nothing I can do. Nope. Big ol' fat castle shot right in the middle. Not much reason I shouldn't be hitting that. to fuck with this anymore, so I'll just leave it at that. 160. <sighs> Type something down real quick. Okay, so there's going to be a bit of a setup here. So if I set if I forget to set this overlay back, please let me know. Yeah, same guy. Yeah, that, this is my tournament too. Same guy. 
every tournament this guy enters, it's always first. He always takes first, and he always dominates. Like I don't, I can't recall ever seeing a close race with this guy. So yeah, this guy needs to start using the new, uh, the new recording feature that a Steam has. I'd like to see how he does that. Yeah. So like I said, like I said, uh, Steam Steam has a new record feature now. Some of these uh, some of these players with absurdly high scores need to start using it. And it in my mind, if I see a score like that, you're guilty until proven innocent. I mean, because if you look at look at the rest of the scores from second place on down. It's actually pretty competitive. Scores are fairly close. I mean, second place, he must have figured out what to do. But I ha kind of have a hard time. I have a hard time believing someone can get 188 mil in only five minutes. Yeah, I suck balls on this one. But otherwise, pretty good tournament. All the scores are close. So. Ah. Uh, I could see 100, maybe even 150 mil on a table like this because traditionally the shots are pretty easy to make on here so you can get a decent score. You can manage to play for a while. See, but number one, yeah, I need to see, see a video on that. So far, I've only seen one person use the uh, record feature. Um, Muddy Wolf, I think his name is. Yeah, he, he records all of his big scores. But like I said, more players need to start using it. So close for a uh, second place too, second and third. Otherwise, pretty good tournament. Yeah, I suck balls on this one. Only 14th, shouldn't have bothered. So, what table this time?
Okay. Alright, Moon Knight, uh, five minute mode. Jump. I don't know. I will not fall. Feels like a good waste of five minutes. With the way I'm shooting. Morning on that would be nice. Morning on that would be nice. I'm missing. <laughs> I know. I suck. that one. Vengeance triumphs. Something on your mind, Crawley? It's not your lucky day, pups. Yeah, skipping this shit, especially on a time mode. Just a scratch. Tis only a flesh wound. Let's pack some punch into the whirly bird, Frenchie. to the ball. Jurassic Park slingshots. It's time to get serious, dude. Run. 
That's all you know how to do. I won that one. Bombs away. I hate the way these balls look. They're hard for me to pinpoint exactly where they are. Oh, there goes one. Score to beat. Yep. Turn all classic. Magnificent skill shot. Splendid super skill shot. Strike one. Strike two. Oh, never mind. That was strike three, so... I gotta avoid that uh, green flashing shot up there. But, no sooner do I say that... I have to hit the whisper shot first on the uh, lower left, which means I probably won't get it. Yeah. Can't make it so there's no point in continuing. I needed her earlier. Oh, strike one.
Lamp dick. Strike three. So. Again, got to avoid the uh, flashing green shot, which means I'll probably end up hitting it. Doom loop. Well, no sooner do I say that, so. Gotta miss the, uh, gotta miss the bumpers, I think. Yeah, so which, um. God, I actually got it. Oh, strike one. Yeah. Beatable score. Sure wish sure wish the game would tell me how poorly I did. Time classic. Didn't see it. Yeah, I I don't want to see that table again. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna do something here that I hadn't done in a long time. Um, I'm gonna pull up an actual video of that. So yeah, this is gonna take a. There's gonna be some setup involved on this.
this video will show I wish this video will show the score. I guess it ain't. All right, I'm looking at one here. Um by Lord Squeak. 369 million, but it took him an hour to get that. And he's playing on classic mode. So, I'm guessing for a score like 237 million, first off, he's gonna have to be playing like Lord Squeak. Lord, for those that don't know, um, Lord Squeak is uh, one of the biggest online pinball legends. Kind of like a Pinball Wiz. 37F or 37B or whatever his name is. And this is normal mode and he's uh, got a score at 237. So, if I was to venture a guess, this would have, he would have to have played this table for at least a half hour, at least 30 minutes and not no freaking five minutes or anything. So, Fifteen billion is another suspicious one. Yeah, I ain't, I'm not real. I just wanted to check that one. I suppose since I'm here. Here's uh, here's Pinball Wiz. Um, he's playing on Classic. Six billion so far that I'm seeing. Wish it would show me. I think it says 6.8 billion. And, um. Damn it, back up, back up. So it took him 35 minutes to get 6.8 billion. Yeah, I don't bother either. I only go for uh, tournaments that have scores that I think I can beat. I waste my time with these ones. So, for a score of 15 billion, I would probably say that he would have to. This had to have taken him at least 30 minutes. But like I said, some of these guys need to make use of the new Steam record function. Avatar moment. Oh, oh. 
Got a feeling I might have wasted time here. Oh, ah, that's right. It's a game bug. No, game bug. Oh, is this what you're looking at? this I am gonna have this table does have copyrighted music let me get this out of here so yeah I am gonna have some of my own music playing in the background since I have the uh, copyrighted music turned off this is a uh, space here where it's always springtime um if you've ever heard any of the uh, old 60s 70s Moog synthesizer music. You'll you'll know it when you see uh when you see like it looks like an organ with a big huge uh switchboard on the back, a whole bunch of buttons and levers and knobs and stuff. That's what this album's supposed to be. It's good or I like it, but it's also extremely repetitious though, so Skill shot. Multiple increase. Watch out. I probably won't make the shot at all. I told you. We're going to miss the hurry up. Well, how about that? Oh, 
flip kick. Oh wait, that's all. Uh, that was time. What the fuck, job there? That's a bad ball save. Sometimes that ball goes straight down the middle after it's being saved. at the entire time. Oh, how about that? I actually made the shot. Double flipper bitch that one. Gotta love it straight down the fucking middle. Drain. Not worth it being up here. Ninety-nine mil, still a beautiful score.
What's this one? Oh, fuck that. Multi-ball? Yeah, I ain't I ain't in the mood to fuck with it. What's gonna pull up the YouTube video on it? Keep saying, Steam's got a new record feature that more players need to start using. Yep. Yep. Called it. Yeah, I shouldn't be very long. I just gotta... Just gotta put my food up. I gotta use the bathroom as well, so... Like I, like I said, I shouldn't be very long. Time for randos. Alien isolation. Alert. 
Something is closing on you. Great! Awesome! Confidence level is a 100%. Watch out for hostile activity. Sevastopol's a supply depot in the region. I can't see it through the monitor. It's gone, Ripley. Oh, that was one ball. Never mind. I have... Here, let me go back to this real quick. I'll show you what I'm trying to talk about. It, when the um, this is a shot eater up here. To make matters worse, when the ball, when the ball comes out of there, it's gonna head straight down to the top of the slingshot, oftentimes bouncing straight into the out lane. So, I have to nudge just before the ball makes contact with that slingshot to try to keep it from going all the way over there, and that does that does cause a fair amount of tilts. But it's. Not much I can do about it. It's a bit of a, it's kind of a design issue. Welcome. And then um. To Jurassic Park. Land. Sometimes you guys will hear me say Jurassic Park slingshots. This this is the table where I got that from, cause. You could practically breathe on these things, and they go off. So that most... I seriously doubt this kind of thing happens in real life. Like, the ball has to actually go into the slingshot in order for it to set it off. The ball in the nest. Like that. Yeah, like that. Chat eater. Magnus save activate. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Video mode is lit. Oh, no, 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 no. They remember. What they got in there, King Kong? And, and yeah, I... I got a nudge once the ball hits that door. This, like I said, Jurassic Park slingshots. Metallic sounds may confuse the raptors. Oh, Not enough, apparently. Good. Hurry. Our moment. Very 
extremely intelligent, and even problem solver intelligent. Come on, come on, we gotta get out of here. Now, now, right now. Go, 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 let's go, hey. Of course I'm not gonna hit it. Must go faster. Magnus save activated. Should have gotten a big score out of that. Hurry. Three. Nothing I can do. One. We pumped the T-Rex to 32 miles an hour. You've heard, you've heard of chaos theory? Magnus save activated. Shot eater. These will be your transports for the afternoon. Combo. Okay, pushing team moving there. I want tasers on full charge. Loading team, step away. Land the ball in the nest. left their blueprints behind for us to find. We just had to know where to look. Magna save stacked. What do they got in there, King Kong? Very good. Oh, 55 mil. Not too bad. I don't... No, I beat my previous. Okay. I thought I had like 80 million on this or something like that. Okay. Guess not. Shall we continue the adventure, Dragonborn? Sure wish I could have this guy for, um, for like matchups and tourneys and stuff. But every time I do those, I got to start over. Kind of bullshitty. The Yarl thinks you could be of use to help in the research into the dragons. Go find the Dragonstone and Bleak Falls Barrow.
Avatar moment. Visit the watchtower. Lock that up real good. Oh, trying to catch the ball. on the bumpers. Oh, okay. oh, fuck. I fucked it up. I fucked it up. Okay. Watch your health. I'm about to die. Told ya. Suppose I have to get another 150, 200 bumper hits or whatever it was. Sure wish I could get in there. Yeah, 30 bumper hits. To fulfill your destiny. I know. I'm a failure.
see a swarm of skeletons sauntering slowly. Don't want the ball in the middle unless absolutely necessary. Like I said. So much for that. Stand a chance, foul monster. Parried! Shoot the sword round for counterattack! Doom loop. Healing potion, a convenient drink for longer battles.
Titans. Unguard my bony adversaries. Oh shit, it just hit me. I have to do that center shot. That's where you, uh, that's where you get your loot. So, yeah, lucky me. Right by me. Hit that back of the table. I wish I could hit something. I see a swarm of skeletons sauntering slowly. Shield and sword, a classic combo. Smack! That's how it's done. Swords. Oh, hey, dice. Uh, no, not much. Just getting over a major back injury.
Yeah. You're dashing. Oh yeah. Shoot everything. This time it was my upper back. That don't happen often. Not so much for that. Um, no, I've never done it. Um, I've liked, uh, I've loved D&D, I've loved D&D, though, ever since, um, uh, childhood. I like everything about it, except for the actual playing of it. I used to play, um, back in the late 70s, early 80s, I got a... Yeah, there was a... I played a board game called... I think it was called Dungeon. Back in the late 70s. Early 80s, I can't remember. There was also a, an old... An old figurine board game. I don't... I don't know the name of it. Well, part of... I mean, part of that... Part of that is on me as well. It is... Maybe because, uh, maybe because, uh, I was into video games and pinball. I was into those years before I even knew about, uh, Dungeons and Dragons. But, um, the few sessions that I had seen over the years, I wouldn't be able to sit still. You know, and that includes, uh, Critical Role. I've tried tried watching that a few times. I just... Uh, 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 so. Truth might be different on the inside, but... Yeah, but from what I'm... From what I'm seeing there, it's just... Yeah. Um, Hero Quest? Uh, let me... Let me type that down. I'd know it if I saw it. No, this ain't it. Um, it's actually an electronic one. Okay, here it is. Bingo. Uh, B 
spell of lost souls? Yeah, electronic Dungeons and Dragons. I think I tried it once. Um, it didn't work on my computer at the time. I can't remember why. There's also, um, there's also Baldur's Gate 3, but um, I, it doesn't look like my computer can handle it. There was a, there's another D and D. I can't remember the name of it. Oh, regular Baldur's Gate. Yeah, I, I played the first two. Um, in fact, the uh, second one, but I'm also the I'm also the kind of person that has to use cheats on them. I prefer to play solo. I don't I don't want to have to clean and press and dress like six characters. That's a whole lot of babysitting. Even if you can um, even if you can um, set them to AI and stuff, it's too much of a pain in the ass. It's like a logistical nightmare. So I prefer to play solo. But yeah, I had to use cheats on that though. I actually lost. I actually streamed it, and uh, I actually lost a regular because of it. Okay. Yeah. Sorry for the interruption, everybody. But yeah, I'll just um I'll add this to my notepad. I'll look at it later. But yeah, I played um I played the other two Baldur's Gates and um uh, all the other um uh, all the other computers I've had over the years, so Enhanced. Okay, yeah, that's that's the link I got. I don't even remember which uh which which uh which version I had like years ago. Like I said, I tried playing it one of those two. It would have worked on my computer for some reason though. Good to know.
So does does Neverwinter Nights, does that work like Baldur's Gate? Like I said, I haven't played it in many years, so I can't remember much about it. Give up? Ha-ha! I have not yet begun to loot! now. I think he's trying to find his weapons. What? He's not even armed? He has a kind of targeting system, right? He's clearly aiming at those targets now. Look at him go! now. It seems the hunter just sealed the breach on the left. No. Oh. This uh. is not a good sign. A nice indication of whether or not I have a kickback over here would have been nice. The, end for us. the moment I saw it go in the outland, I said, oh, fuck it, game over. Oh, I beat my previous score. Yeah, in case you're curious, um, the only D and D uh, session I've seen that I was remotely interested in was probably uh, I think its name is uh, the Cosmonaut Variety Hour. I kind of, I kind of like the setup. One thing that really killed it for me for a lot of the uh, the sessions I've been watching is one, they're actually like overproduced. Critical Role was a, was a prime example of that. You just got a whole shit ton of cameras, and they're just going all over the place. It's just ah. And then you also had um some of the others I've watched also very disorienting. And you have like you have like six different people. It kind of looks like the uh, game show Hollywood Squares. It's just you got a whole bunch of them talking at once or doing different shit. It's just but Cosmonaut Variety Hour was probably the most aesthetically pleasing, for lack of a better word. But even then, nearly everything they were saying was like going like one ear and out the other.
All right, copyrighted music. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna have. To... So yeah, I yeah, I'm gonna have to have some mu some of my own music going in the background, cause the silence is gonna drive me nuts. Let's do this thing. and everything. Every time the ball hits the slingshot, it just <laughs> makes it hard to see. Shots. Oh, oh. No. I wasn't paying attention. Nice. You don't have what it takes. 
Flashing. Watch out! Good job. I'll protect her no matter what. Take this stuff. Good job. Get in there somehow. Good shot. Just skipping this one. I forgot to mention earlier, um, last table for FX3. Not oh, beating the previous. Not by much, but. So, yeah, like I said, this is gonna do it for uh, FX3. Gonna go on an intermission, and I'm gonna start, or when I get back, it'll be Pinball Arcade. all this time.
another one of these. Kinda has it up there in the nosebleed seats. Rock, 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 all their games. But anyway, I'll be back.
that you? Ah, good seeing you, buddy. Oh, I wish. I couldn't do it in this apartment. Well, um... Oh, wow, that was... That's it? Well, in recent news, I, um... Big time major in my upper back. Apparently, I slept wrong, so... I gotta turn this down. But yeah, uh, earlier a guy named Dice Chuck came on. Um, we talked about Dungeons and Dragons a little bit. Uh, I said, I love everything, I basically love everything about it, except for the actual playing of it. Yeah, there's a chance that tomorrow I might be calling in, but we'll see it come tomorrow. But. Hey, he showed me a uh, showed me a game I ought to try out. Um, Never Winter Nights Enhanced Edition. So I might look into that. But yeah, like I was telling him, it is D and D is hard for me to watch. I mean, I the 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 sessions I've watched over the years, even Critical Role, it just. Uh, like, it'd be hard for me to stay awake. <laughs> Probably because pinball and video games got me first. No, no. This is, uh, one of Kitaro's videos. Well, I guess I could be one of my, um, one of my big pipe dreams there if I... If I ever got a big house or something, or if I was able to somehow swing it, get a, get my own pinball arcade going. Get by. Get Maybe. Lamp dick. Love the flippers. Bobble the ball. Don't flip. Flip.
Yeah. Good old classic 80s Bally. You got that in your back pocket, huh? Black hole? Oh, yeah. Yeah, uh, now that I think about it, I did act, I did actually play that table in real life. Um, I can't remember where. I want to say it was... Um, have you ever heard of a place called KOA Campgrounds? I want to say there. Maybe not KOA, but it was a campground of some kind. You know, like in, the, um, like in a community center. You know, where they have the lunches and bingos and stuff like that. I think they had a black hole, uh, black hole table in there. I think they also had a, they had an arcade game called Star Castle. I think they had that there as well. Okay, I, I don't care about this part. Alright, so we're gonna go and start firing up Pinball Arcade. we go. Not the best way to start. Oh. Well, that was. happen often. Of course, of course you lose all, two of them almost fucking immediately. Oh. Yay, big fanfare celebration for the, for the 175,000 jackpot. Sounds familiar. Okay. 
You ever want to be a wife beater? This is the table for you. Uh. Not once, but twice. once but twice. Like I said, this don't happen often. Usually this table's a quick three and out. Oh. Yep. Pussy plunged that. Yep, here we go with this again. Measly score. Which, of course, that ain't gonna happen. Ball three. Let's get out of there. straight down the middle. Big shot. Double flipper, bitch.
this is uh this table is actually really great for beginners I mean you got a you got a big ass wide open play field here there's there's not yeah there's not a whole lot of bullshit on here and uh, the objective the objectives are fairly simple you don't you don't need a you don't need a damn flow chart for the thing just take down the drop targets and the eight ball preferably in that order so it ain't rocket science and then nice little uh nice little quirk uh once you get to ball four all the shots are worth uh two thousand on the very last ball they're worth three thousand so and i don't i don't recall ever seeing this on any other table The only, the only real big problem that this table has. No. Nope. I got to get control of the ball first. It's got the same problem that a Zachariah has on their tables. kind of look the slingshots on here they kind of stick out in front of the flippers a lot of Zacharias tables has that problem as well that should never happen slingshots need to be behind the base of the flipper not sticking out in front of them Flipper, bitch. And I don't get any of them. Yeah, like I said, that bad positioning on those slingshots. All-time favorite table.
And there's actually a fair amount to this table, but I, until I get to that point, I probably won't talk much about it. There's an easy method and there's a hard method on here. But as I like this table too much, I always go for the hard method. Extra ball is a big priority. Got it. Otherwise, for multi ball, what little you saw of that, just basically keep doing what you're doing. Okay, I guess now that I'm at that point, I'll go ahead and explain how the table works. Basically, the easy method is just simply getting the lit in lane and then shooting the lit spinner, rinse and repeat. You get like 10, 10k per spin. So yeah, that's a lot of points. But again, I like this table too much for that. So the hard method is just try to get the energy meter up to the top to where you can uh, get a ball lock. Um, you do that by hitting the orange target, which gives you two energy. There's also a target back here by the bumper, behind the bumpers. It also gets you two energy. Um, if you take down a bank of drop targets, it gives you one energy. But if you could take down both banks, as you can see here, it'll increase your multiplier. I'm to where now, excuse me, taking down a bank will give me three energy. So, once you do get the, once you get the lock lit, you have to shoot the flashing ramp. Most often, it's going to be this one here. And then, if and when you do get multi-ball, I said it earlier, it's all about getting that extra ball. It's going to be in one of these two targets. Um, but if you lose multi-ball, you lose the, you lose the, uh, the lit extra ball as well. So, that's why it's high priority. Uh, but otherwise, during multi-ball, like I said earlier, keep doing what you're doing. So. this has to be done on one ball otherwise it all resets
Power <laughs> drain. Well, today's your lucky day, yeah. Get it. So it's three banks I gotta get. Straight down the middle. No, nope. trying to catch the ball. So much luck this time. I'd like to be able to hit that uh, K target up there. It's flashing. Jack shit this time. Say good night, punk. Hey, 
Yeah, today's your lucky day, Hap. This was one of those few times where I truly sucked balls on that table. I couldn't even get in the damn lower plate field. Yeah, I, um, uh, I've tried that class before. Um, couldn't really get into it much. It's one of those. Actually, now that I think about it, a lot of those classes are, are um, following its example now. It's like, every minute, you have to pop all the buffs and stuff, and that's when you do your big-time damage burst. But after that... You're pretty much just marking time. You're just doing busy work. toward I like them both for different reasons monk at least it's one of the reasons why I'm so burnt out on MMOs it just wow had it runescape kind of has it and 14 has it guild wars 2 it has it technically but not nearly as bad that global cooldown at least with monk you, you know you can still you can still move around and stuff their whole um their whole DPS is centered around that ninja less so they're more about getting that sneak attack I think it's called yeah even on those MMOs there's a lot of there's it's almost like there's this huge idol aspect to it I know 14 has that two and a half second global cooldown. It's like, I mean, there's, um, there's Instacast stuff, but it's not, to my knowledge, it's not like it's part of the, uh, part of the rotation. WoW has a, has a second and a half, but you know, when you get to a point where you're really good, where you're really good at that game, the second and a half is way too long. And two and a half is is freaking worse. Yeah, but that is that is definitely one good thing about fourteen though. You can use controller, mouse, keyboard, and I think you can use all three of them interchangeably. Yeah, 
Now, like I said, from what I played of uh, Machinist, though, I think other classes these days are following that pattern. Like, you... I don't know the name of the ability. Like, increases all your damage by 50% for 10 seconds or whatever the hell it's called. You have that short burst window. You gotta pop all your cooldowns, and that's when you do all your damage and all that. And then, But after that, you're basically... Twiddling thumbs until your DPS ability comes off cooldown, and then you pop everything and do your burst damage, and then after that, yeah. It's yeah, it's probably also one of the reasons why I stream pinball these days. There's like no. No global cooldown on pinball, so... But... Guild Wars 2 kinda has that. If you use it, I, I don't know if you... I can't remember if you actually played it or not. There's a weapon on there called the uh, Mortar Gun. Freaking love that get love that weapon. Yeah. I can't remember if um I don't I don't remember I don't I think there was a global cooldown on Guild Wars 2. But there's a lot of, um... I don't know. I could see it, though. I know they, um... They got a fair amount of expansions ever since I stopped playing. I'm kind of interested, though. So, I'm on Google right now. Uh, um. Well, here's a bingo. Um. Guild Wars 3 announcement at NC Soft here. Let me do let me stop a second. So you guys get a chance to read this too. Yeah, about eight months ago. Guild Wars 3 has not been approved and is not being developed. It's in the uh, review stage. So they're they're talking about it. Yeah. Nope. And this answered my question. There is no global cooldown in Guild Wars 2. That's probably why it's my favorite MMO. Wait a minute, it's a whole, uh, it's a whole Reddit post. Yeah, it's, but it is, it is pretty, um, rotation dependent. You use your skills back to back in a meaningful order. Each skill, it's, yeah, each skill has its own cooldown. I think I said that a few minutes ago.
Yeah, and they're talking about it here, too. Yeah, sorry for the interruption, everybody. Just kind of had me interested. And then, something else I keep, I keep forgetting to mention, too. For those that don't know, Aptitude and I, we've known each other for many years. So, I think him and I, years ago, we were in the same Final Fantasy XIV guild. So, we go back a while. Right light. If I can get one more, it'll be some awesome music. So, multi ball, hit the left ramp. And um, there it is. There's a space behind the drop targets. But otherwise, it rinse and repeat and went right by me. Radar indicates an extra ball. Did I get it? Trying to hit the right ramp. Got it. Great shot. Did I hit it? Yeah, I got it. Missile destroyed. No, missed it. Sure wish I could hit the left ramp. Lamp deck. Shoot left ramp. Is 
sector house sector is destroyed. Is destroyed. Okay, that's what I got to aim for. Failures. Nope. Got that shit about the blow. about to be glowing in the dark there for a second. That out, bro, cuz. Okay, uh, fuck you. Challenge is lit. Of course I'm not gonna hit it. This is the, I don't want to say though, it's not the true wizard mode. All the good of that did me.
Try to hit the left loop. Dick. Captain, she's about to blow. Oh, got it. A very hard shot to get into. You have to take down the drop targets first. And then your shot, it pretty much has to be dead on balls accurate. Got it. But rinse and repeat. Left ramp. lagged. Oh. 
juice left. Mega City One is blacked out. Be on the alert for looters. Send back a few men. Not so much for that. Always gotta go on the alt lane anyway, so. Oh, I forgot to mention. Um, last table. Yeah, I'm going to Zachariah after this. gonna do it for a uh, pinball arcade I'm gonna switch on over to uh, Zachariah Just trying to play all the platforms something's missing Universe Deluxe. Not a good way to start. Don't fear, people. Captain Zack is here. Or some bad voice acting. Complaining. Oh god, this table sucks ass. Which ain't gonna last long.
Lamp deck. This is almost a fucking punishment, not a reward. This table fucking drags, especially when a mode starts. Mexico, 86. <laughs> yeah, I don't get this table very often, so I know next to nothing about it. Shot myself in the foot there. That little sound effect came from mom. I was off of Crystal Castles. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Trying to catch the ball. Whoa. Almost. I beat my previous score. Alright, I gotta look at something real quick. It looks like I could shoot the ball straight through there. 
it wasn't letting me. something I wasn't paying attention looking elsewhere it's all my fault on that one Star God Retro. That was a flipper, bitch. Pool Champion Remake. Smacking the shit out of that target. That. Ramp award. Combo. <laughs> Double Exactly. 
activated. Fuck! You potted the cue ball! Combo! Double combo! Triple combo! Combo. Shoot again is activated. Don't move. Orbit award. Multi ball is lit. There goes the cue ball. Yep. Chance of me doing decent on this table. Call shot. Combo. Double the combo. Don't shoot again is activated. Lamp deck. Shoot again is activated. Combo. Double combo. Lamp deck. That's a floppy ass flippers. And there goes the one. Yep, there goes that. Caveman. It's a homebrew table. for losing.
Postal Redux Solid State. Out. Shots fired. I need backup. Uh, something went wrong there. I should have caught that ball in the right foot, but didn't do it for some reason. out. Oh.
stuff is special. I suppose, um, there's something I was wanting to say here. I suppose they had to say murder hostiles because if it said just murder or murder person, they probably would have gotten, gotten in some kind of legal trouble for that, for being too offensive. sucked. Fire Mountain Retro. Yeah, I'm going to be shutting down pretty soon here, too. right over the bumper. Top five percent, that's kind of surprising. Woods Queen. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, call this my last table.
Alright. Thanks for dropping by. But yeah, I'm gonna be um, calling it off here pretty quick too, so. But good seeing you, yeah, See ya next time, buddy. I'll beat my previous. So yeah, that's gonna do it for me, everybody. Um, following right along, aptitude. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and call it good. Um, the upper back is only hurting a little bit, but actually this time around, my left elbow is starting to get sore. Um, yeah. So yeah, there's something else I was wanting to say. Um, I fair amount of post production on my video. There might be a a video clip or two that I want to make as well. So, and then um, there's still my gems of war session that I need that I need to get taken care of too. So, there shouldn't be much on that. But uh, we'll I'll see you when I actually get into it. So, but yeah. But otherwise, uh, pretty good session. Uh, this is one of those times where uh, Pinball Arcade and Zachariah here actually went a lot better than FX3 did. Usually it's the other way around. It starts out with uh, FX3. Doing really good, then Arcade, eh. Then Zachariah sucking ass, but not in this session. So, but otherwise, uh, thanks for dropping in and hanging out with me, everybody. I appreciate that. And then, as of right now, my work week has started up tonight, tomorrow, and Friday. That's normally my work week. What tonight might be an exception, though. Like I said, it, it all hinges on a how well my upper back is, or how well my upper back is. If it's uh, if it's still hurting too much, I may end up uh, call. I may end up calling in because I, I, I can't go in. I can't go into work, or I even if it's a three day, three day work week with a hurt back, I could probably handle a two day, two day work week. But once again, we'll, we'll see you come tonight. So. There, there may be a chance that I might be coming on tonight if I called it. So, but, oh, and, and if I do, my default time is 9 p.m. And that is U.S. Central Time. So, but, until then, thanks again for coming by, everybody. And I'll see you all next time.